It's been a long walk for Dan Reinke. 99 days, about 2,510 miles, and about 5 million and maybe 300,000 footsteps. <laughs> In May, he stood on an Oregon beach at the Pacific Ocean. Then he turned east with a mission to accomplish more than just a cross-country hike. The best word would be to call it a pilgrimage, and um, it's, it's also a, a personal journey uh, in striving to grow closer to God. Dan grew up Catholic, but fell away from the church. That slide ended about two years ago, and he says his return has brought more happiness than he ever imagined. Now he hopes to spread that feeling by encouraging other Christians to fearlessly live out their faith. When you hear a lot of uh, negative on the news, and you um, sometimes it can it can kind of be depressing. And I think uh, people are looking for uh, something uh, something that'll inspire. And um, God's allowed this trip to do that. Dan's not a preacher. He lets his sign do the talking. It proved to be enough to pique the curiosity of a number of people along his three-month journey. I saw the whole backpack and all the thing and I'm like what are you doing I think it's incredible you know I think that's what we need that's what our country is lacking what uh, the Lord <laughs> though it's been lonely Dan's felt the touch of kindness from strangers free meals free beds a cup of coffee or an encouraging word there's a lot of good people out there is what I've uh, come to come to find and a lot of people that took care of me along the way and Lots of different ways, whether conversation or coffee or breakfast or a uh, small donation or big donation. His long road ended at the Virginia Beach Boardwalk, diving into the ocean, feeling the cool water rinse off the dirt and sweat. It seems like a baptism. For having completed his mission, he now begins life anew. All done. <laughs> Ephraim Graham, CBN News.